Welcome back to 100 Days of Startup, where I, Rod Dannon, and building Prentice, where we connect startups to skill tech interns that they can hire. Today is day 78, and we are wrapping up quickly in the 100 Days of Startup. Uh, but for today, you know, after a crazy election night and day, uh, I think after wasting some time already, I, I'm kind of, you know, past it and will not be paying attention. So should be more productive tomorrow, even though I got some personal stuff. But first, today, um, first thing was, you know, going through some email since I've actually just been letting stuff build up, anything that, that I haven't had to answer. Um, it's just kind of been sitting there. So I'm referring mainly to, you know, newsletters, but you know, newsletters are important. I got to keep learning, um, whether it be product, marketing, whatever it might be. Um, so I read one and within one minute, um, one, it basically triggered a realization on the show end. So, so we have our live show season two was set to start in November, but just because, you know, I took, took like a month break and I want to keep the momentum going, but I realized that. You know, there's so many more important things right now. And I think the show is very important. I want, but that's the thing I want to do it right. I want to make sure that we do the right production. We do all the branding, set up the website, connect it to the podcast. And then guy will learn how to do the editing. We make the intro. And right now we have too much stuff on the design side for me to divert guys attention to that. And my own attention to that, uh, especially because, you know, I have to also go out and get more, more guests to, to actually be on the show, I'd have to reach out to, to different bootcamp grads so you don't build up the audience and some you know, fresher people to the job search. So I decided we're postponing it until January, you know, because anyways, we would have had to skip Thanksgiving week, um, what's it called, it's Christmas week, and it just, it would have been a mess. So starting in January, we already have two guests. Facebook designer, and then a product manager that's actually a really good writer. So he's a product manager at a company called Blend. Um, so two guests are ready, which is great. And, you know, I'll fill out the calendar over over December once I can actually focus more on that kind of stuff. Um, and then we're going to do it right. I think in, the st in startup land, it's always a, a kind of pressure to do everything fast and now and push, 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 push. Um, and you know, especially I want to make I want to make money ASAP, but you gotta sometimes just pause and be like, hey, it's better if we put it off. So that's what I did. Uh, then for the rest of the day, you know, kind of put the bad sleep and lunch process kind of out of things. Um, but in the afternoon, I was supposed to meet with a bootcamp partner, so I mentioned that, but they end up rescheduling for tomorrow, so nothing on that end. But you know, it gives me some extra time to make the site better and improve the presentation uh, while doing some bubble edits. I decided to check if anyone from the email I sent out yesterday had signed up. So it turns out that one person signed up, but they ran into an error. And then I checked the logs on LogRocket, which actually records the whole session. So I saw they did something and then it broke it. Uh, it was one of these plugins added. So I had to remove that and then fix some of the other things I noticed that were weird in terms of how they were getting routed. So I fixed that and then emailed them asking for another shot. They finished registration but then they didn't book a meeting, which is the last step to you know get approved to the pro the platform. Um, so that's interesting, you know. Uh, I need I need to get more data to see if like that's like the big turnoff for businesses. But this business also didn't seem like the exact fit. I think they were a smaller company, 10, 20 employees. So I won't cry too much over it. But it's something to watch. Then in the evening, we had the weekly designer meeting, so we are losing one one of our most important designers um, at the end of this week, uh, and hopefully she can get some good stuff done over the next few days. So we have some stuff for the developers to work on until I find a new designer that can you know fully take on her stuff. But overall, it was a good meeting. We kind of we just changed some things in the design system, made it look a little bit nicer, and experimented with like dashboard menus. Um, but also talked about UX, like what's needed, different styling. So great, great discussion today, even though it was like a smaller people. Um, and yeah, it was a good prep for them uh, in anticipation of tomorrow's all hands meeting for the project. So uh, overall, not the most productive day, but still good things we got done. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. And again, subscribe and tell your friends. I'll tell you about everything tomorrow.